we take an example a ball thrown up in air reaches a maximum height of 150 meter and travels a horizontal distance of 100 meter draw curve tracing the path of the ball here the horizontal distance 100 meter and at half distance that is at point O we will draw the axis of the parabola maximum height that is 150 meter since we can see that the dimensions are very large which cannot be drawn on sheets so we will take scale that is 1 meter equal to 1 millimeter so that will give horizontal distance 100 meter equal to 100 millimeter and vertical distance 150 millimeter so now we start from drawing base AB and the axis OC base is 100 millimeter we will mark midpoint at 50 millimeter and draw a horizontal line this will be A B and center O then marking a perpendicular we will draw the axis mark this point point C then by using base and axis we will draw a rectangle now we start constructing a parabola here in this example we can see the parabolic curve the right side and the left side both the sides are similar so we need to draw half curve at this side and remaining curve will be just copied so we start from this side first we will divide this vertical line into number of parts and this horizontal line into number of parts the number of division should be same for both since we can see that the base from A to O is 50 millimeter so we can easily take 5 equal division at every 10 millimeter the vertical line is 150 millimeter so we can take 5 parts at every 30 millimeter now we connect point number one at which is at vertical line with C then we connect point number two with C then 3 and 4 now match the ruler scale with the axis slide it till point 1 which is on the horizontal line and draw a vertical line which will meet at line number 1 this will give point P1 similarly match roller scale with the axis slide it to point number 2 which is on horizontal line and then draw a vertical line which will connect point line number 2 and this will give you point P2 similarly for P3 and P4 now by joining point A, P1, P2, P3, P4 and C 
we will get half of parabola. So we connect it by using a French curve. This particular portion can be joined by French curve. This is the best profile you can get here. Try to connect minimum three points at a time. Then we can connect P3, P2 and P1. And finally A and P1. Now we can repeat the same procedure for this rectangle and complete the curve else we can just copy these points to save time. So we will match the roller scale with the base that is horizontal line then you slide it till point P1 and draw a horizontal line. Then P2, then transfer P3, and then P4. Now measure the distance P1 from the axis and copy the same dimension to the next rectangle. Then measure P2 from center axis and transfer the same dimension and P3 and P4. Then name these points then connecting these points we will get the complete parabola then connecting these points starting from C And finally, P8 to point B. So here we get the complete parabola. Give dimensions 